Well, hello, everybody. It's Lady G. How is everybody doing? Did y'all sleep well last night? That is what I would like to know. Y'all know it's important to get our sleep now because when you get your sleep, you reju regenerate, rejuvenate, and energize your mind, your body, and your soul. So I'm hoping everybody got their sleep. Well, y'all, before we get into what we're getting into, let me tell you what I'm drinking. Now, this morning, y'all, I'm still experimenting with this sea moss, y'all. And so this morning, I made, I used sea moss, and I put blueberries in it, a little bit of agave syrup, and a, just two drops of the digestion essential oil and that's to help your digestive system y'all so i'm still experimenting with the sea moss so far it's good but when i put the essential oil in this one it kind of gave it a flavor of it's a hint of the black licorice if if you know what i mean so it's not bad but it's a little different than what i expected but i'm still gonna drink it because you know sea moss y'all and and I told y'all I was going to tell y'all how I um, prepared my sea moss. Well, I was watching, girl, I was on them YouTube streets, and I saw a YouTuber, a big YouTuber, was talking about sea moss. And she said, when you get your sea moss, to soak it overnight. And that helps it to plump up. She ain't lie, y'all. I soaked it overnight, and it began to plump up. It began to uh, rehydrate. Then she said to rinse it, because you get all that grit and salt or whatever it is in it. All that grit kind of soaks, seeps down to the bottom. And then I took that and I rinsed that off. And then I soaked it again. Then I rinsed it. And then I soaked it for a little while longer. And then I took it out. Rinsed it real good in, 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 in a little strainer. And I rinsed it really well. And, made, and it was so nice and plump. Then I put it in my blender. And she said to cover it just, just to the top. Just to the top of the sea moss in your blender and blend it. And that's what I did. And so I have a jar of it. And she said, don't keep it for no one, two or three days. And so today is what the third day. So I'm going to use it all today. She said she used it on her skin. She used it in her smoothies. And she make um, moss sauce. Some people say applesauce. But I call it moss sauce because it's sea moss. And you can put apples in it. You can put whatever you want to put in it. You can put your strawberries like I did the other day. So that's, I told you I was going to tell you how I made my sea moss, how I prepared my sea moss. So when I buy it from the health food store, wherever I get it from, then I'm going to soak it overnight and rinse it. And I'm going to just keep rinsing it. And then I'm going to soak it a little, a little while longer. Then she said to put a little bit of lime in it. Just cut up your little lime and that would take out that sea taste. And it actually absolutely works so i just wanted to share that with y'all in case y'all wanted to know about sea moss it's supposed to be very very healthy for us i have not uh i don't remember all the health benefits to it but one of these days maybe i come in the garden and i'll tell you about it well y'all we got that out the way i wanted to come in and do an update a garden update with you guys because as y'all know i was out of town and went to my mom's surprise birthday party i'm still hyped about that y'all and so I had some family, some friends come over and they, they were watering my groceries and taking care of my groceries. So y'all, it is time for me to harvest my sweet potatoes or uh, yams or whatever y'all want to call them. But I think they sweet potatoes. So what we're going to do is we're going to pause for the calls. I'm going to go out to the garden, y'all, and we're going to harvest some potatoes. So sit tight and I'm going to be right back. All right. But first of all, first, I'm going to drink this, y'all. Blueberry sea moss smoothie. It's, can y'all can y'all get in that? Can y'all get with that? Look at that. That is, I'm telling y'all, it's good and it's very filling too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna meet y'all outside in the garden. And we're going to harvest some, some sweet potatoes if they're ready. I think they're ready. What y'all think? Let's look. Well, all right, y'all. We back in the garden. I'm putting my gloves back on. And we're going to go in here and see if these potatoes are ready to be harvested. I don't have one of those. Um, let me see. Let me see. I'm going to turn y'all around this way. Yeah, we over here. I want y'all to see the process. See the process. Can y'all see? I think y'all can see. Okay. I'm going to go through and I'm going to dig through here. Oh, Lord, this whole thing coming up, y'all. 
Oh, y'all. Uh-oh, wait a minute. They kind of small. But they coming on up and out, out of here. Let me see. Can y'all see? Can y'all see what's going on? Oh, them little. Are they ready, Jesus? I don't know if they, they kind of, I don't know if they ready. They kind of small, y'all. Y'all see that? Y'all see them? Okay, there you go. Y'all see them? Kind of small. They are smaller ones, though. Let's see. See there? Kind of small. So, I don't know if I should pick them all out or... But I'm going to see, because these right here, they ain't ready. Y'all see that? Look at that, y'all. I mean, wow. See that? Oh. Some of them kind of little. I don't know. Maybe they not ready. Okay, that's real small, too. They kind of little and skinny. Let me see. I think I see a big one, y'all. Let's see. Well, no. They, they kind of weird looking under here. Look, that look like a little... Can y'all see that? Look at that, y'all. I don't know. Maybe I should let them stay out here a little longer. I don't know. See how little they is? See how that one? That's a little one, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and take him off. Look at that. See, I'm going to put him. See that? Put them in there. Can y'all see that? Y'all see them? Okay, let's see. I'm going to go just going to. I think I'm going to leave some of these right in here. Because they look kind of small, y'all. Let's see, I got one that's just right here sticking up like he ready. Look at that. See that? He just came on up out the ground. Look at that. Y'all see that? Y'all. Let me see. It might be another one down here closer. Yeah, I got my gloves on, y'all. Mm-mm. Okay, let's see what we got. Let's see. Let's see. Got a little bitty something. Some of them are still kind of little, so I'm not really sure if they really, really ready. So I think I'm going to let them stay a little while longer. I'm going to dig over here and see what I can find. Because Now, this one right here was coming up. Can y'all see that one? Let me see. He was coming up. See, look at that. There you go. Look at that, y'all. Y'all, Lady G is growing some yams, y'all. And it's okay that they small. I'm okay with that. You know, in the book it says, Despise not the day of small beginnings. <coughs> Excuse me. Or small things. That's kind of small. But I'm okay with it, y'all. I'm okay with it. Look, the Lord blessed me to grow these with my own hands, y'all. I'm so excited. Look at there. Let me see if I can get one more out, and then I think I'm going to let these sit for a little, for another couple of weeks. And then I'm just going to come in and take them all out. Because, see, some of them is really, really, look, that's just tiny. He just, he needs just going on somewhere right there. Where he come with that little old? Okay, let me see. See if it's one right here. Let's see, y'all. Wait a minute. He's trying to bring up the whole bed. Let's see. Now, watch he do all this all this trouble, and then it's going to be a little old bit of something. So something I'm going to be the littlest one that make the most noise. Okay. What I'm going to do, y'all, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let these sit for a little while, a couple more weeks. Because they kind of really tiny. So, I don't know if they're ready. So, we're going to come in, and we're going we gonna, to we gonna take these up, you know, uh, a little later. Because they still kind of small. Like, these right here. This little root right here. See this right here? This little root right here. I don't know what's going on. Why is she acting like that? Let's see. Well, let's see. We got another one up in here. Girl, they up in here, y'all. Let me see. Oh, hey. Hey, now. Oh, Lord. Let's see what's going on. Well, y'all get a look at. Look, y'all. Girl, these potatoes, y'all. They growing into like they want to be uh instruments. It look like a trumpet or something. Y'all, this is, this is just so nice. Look at that. Okay, I'm just gonna take these through. I don't know why they so skinny, but you know what? Let's see. Can y'all see that? Let's see. Yeah, there you go. Look, look at them, y'all. So I'm gonna come back and get the rest of them. I'm gonna give them a couple more weeks and see if they're gonna get a little bigger. I think they're just gonna get longer though, y'all. What y'all think? Somebody tell me. Tell me what y'all think. I'm going to see if I can flip this camera around to see if we can get a better a better view of what's going on. Let's see. Yeah. There we go. Now I can see what y'all see. See them? What is really going on with my potatoes, y'all? My yams. I'm going I'm to go ahead and cook these today, though, y'all. 
rinse them off real good look at that and it's a lot of more under there but they really small so i'm not sure if they're ready for me to to get on. look at oh look at big papa there's big papa right there y'all okay well i just wanted to give y'all a garden update so y'all can see what's going on in the garden uh when i got back i, I knew it was time to start harvesting my potatoes yeah i think this is a better view for for us to see together so we can go on this journey together. Well, I'm just gonna dig through here and see if I can find something else that might be ready to get on up out of here. Something else ready? Because those were sticking up through the soil. So I don't see anything else right there. So I'm just trying to dig in here and see. And this is um okay, I don't see anything else. I don't feel anything else over there. I'm just trying to see what's going on in the garden, y'all. Okay, let's see. I think it's something else over here, y'all. Let's see. I'll take y'all with me. Uh-oh. Wait. Wait a minute. Y'all. Look, y'all. Bingo. Bingo. Okay, so it's still... Let's see. There you go. Look at that. Look at that, y'all. I'm liking it, y'all. I'm liking it. I'm. This is absolutely amazing okay okay let's see because you can they were sticking up and that's why i said oh they probably they ready to come on out because they sticking up they said hello when i came back here they were sticking up saying hello these are sweet potatoes y'all here's my little sign right here so they ready they ready y'all let's see what's over here and what is over here okay i think whatever's over here might need to stay a little longer yeah them little they little bitty they some little bitties but we're gonna see what's going on i got something over here trying to trying to get my attention i mean she just grew like real skinny let's see let's get on over here because she look at her y'all you yeah, y'all see her look at her right here let me get this one out the way. Look, she is like real skinny. She's still going down. Look at that. See, but that's okay. Y'all, this is my first time. This is my first time. So I'm trying to see what's going on over here. Let's see, somebody calling my name. Let's see who calling me over here. Nobody. Oh, wow. Okay. Here we go. Here go another little one. They just little. Yeah, I see. It's a lot of little ones under here. So, I'm going to let them stay under there and see if they're going to do something nice for me. It's a lot of little, little, little ones. So, I don't know. We'll see. I, I've disturbed the ground. Who's disturbing my ground? Okay. This is another little one. Y'all, this is so amazing and so exciting because you don't never know what you're going to get. Y'all remember Forrest Gump saying, life is like a box of chocolate. You never know what you're going to get. Y'all, when I feel them, now this one is going to be small. I feel it. So, I'm not going to, I'm going to come back and get the rest of these. But I just wanted to come in and give y'all an update on what was going on in the garden with my groceries. And that is just amazing. Y'all, I'm so excited. Okay, so far, this is what we've harvested from my sweet potatoes, y'all. We're going to have sweet potatoes tonight, y'all. So excited. Okay, so let me give you a tour of what's, what else is going on in the garden. Okay, these are some peppers. They just act like they didn't want to make it. Now, I took one of these peppers with me when I went out of town. Where'd she go? She right here. Look, y'all, trying not to put my hands on because I've been digging in the dirt. But look at that. She is ready. And look at this little critter. Can y'all see this little critter right here? I don't know where it went. It's orange and it just be all over my little plants. There she go. Look, look. Y'all see it? What is that? And why is she in, in my groceries? She need to go to the store and find her own groceries just like I do. And they sting too. Because I tried to get one one time with my with my hand. And it stung me, honey. Went on by this business. Yep. I get them though. 
Oh, look, y'all. Y'all see that? Look at that pepper. Oh, and it's like, it's growing like a banana pepper, y'all. What is really going on in the garden? I'm loving it. All right, let's see what else we got. Y'all, look, we got two. We got two peppers. Can y'all, look, y'all. It's two of them. Oh, and they are loving life. They are living their life on purpose. Look, y'all. Let me see. This one is trying. Oh, look, there's another visitor. What is the problem? They need to go to the store and get their own groceries. I'm trying to hide from me, but I got you. Look. Can y'all see him? I don't know. He must have. He, he jumped off. He didn't want to ride on my hand because he knew I was going to take him somewhere else. Y'all. Let me see if I can show y'all again the peppers. Here are some more bell peppers. I harvest some before I left. And they just keep right. And look at, oh man. Look, I got some more um sweet peppers, y'all. Look at this garden is producing. Look. Ta -da, ta -da, ta -da, ta -da. Look at there, y'all. Let me go on this side and see what we have coming now. Y'all, this is a serious update. Look. Look at that pepper. You see what we have? Oh, y'all, look at this pepper. And it's beautiful. You know, it's small, but I think I'm going to go ahead and harvest that bad boy. Because, look at this. I don't know what these critters are, y'all, but look at it. Let's see. Can y'all see him? Look at him. What is that? And why is he? He camera shy, that's for sure. But he going to be gone. Okay. Y'all, my peppers are doing well. Thank the Lord. Look at this. Look at that, y'all. Can y'all believe that? Okay, y'all, here, here are my mustard greens. I'm going to pull just a few of them just to get them, just to have them, y'all. So I can go eat them with my... Can you see that together? Some yams and some mustard greens. Oh, my goodness. Okay, my berry tree, it still isn't producing. I'm wondering if I need to cut it back. And see, since the birds came and, and robbed, they robbed me. They robbed me, y'all. They did. Okay, my tomatoes, I harvested them before I left and ate them, y'all. And look. Ta -da! Look at what is going on with the tomato. I just finished um, pruning it and cutting it back. So we'll see what's going on. Y'all, I'm just so excited. I'm going to take you over here and I'm going to show you. I'm going to show y'all. Uh, let's see. Y'all, look at my pineapples. Y'all see them? Them pineapples is coming on through. And then I have some ginger back here. The ginger is showing up and showing out. Pretty soon I'm going to have to put her in a larger pot. Look at there. And then look, y'all, more pineapples. So I'm excited. I just wanted to come and give you all an update as I harvest my yams, my sweet potatoes, and to let y'all see what was going on in the garden, y'all. Oh, y'all in my raised bed, y'all. It's I'm going to be finished with this today. Bam! Look at that, y'all. That is coming along nicely, my raised bed. Remember the wood I showed y'all when it got? Yes. I had a very faithful, good friend came over and showed me how to use the drill and how to um, change out the bits and how to drill the holes in, the screws in. I'm telling you. Then I painted it down with some, treat. I treated it with some of that, um, I, I forgot what kind of oil it is, but some type of seed oil or something, oil seed, whatever, that treats wood. So, y'all, she going to be ready. So, when I finish with it, hopefully today, I'm going to take another picture and uh, let y'all see the update. But, y'all, this is Lady G. Coming to y'all straight from Lady G's Garden Cafe. And I just wanted to come in and do an update on the garden. And I just want to tell y'all to live y'all life, to enjoy y'all life, and to enjoy it. You got it. On purpose. Well, y'all, until the next upload. Later, y'all.